All right, so let's do day 17 on 24 days of matcha. Uh, the box has been uh, nibbled on by the bunny. Uh, so apparently it's tasty. There goes uh, being able to reuse that box, unfortunately. He also ate some of my whiskey bits. Um, I do have another whisk, but I think this one still has enough that it should be fine. Uh, I'm finding little whisk doodads all over the table. Uh, so Jack is trouble. Alright, let's go. Top corner. So day 17. Orange dreamsicle. Let's do 8 grams. The water's heating to 165. It smells like something, but I can't think of what. Not orange creamsicles. I can't place that. Almost like an orange cleaning product. Not great. Uh, <laughs> hopefully it tastes better than it smells. Um, Cause that's uh, a little weird. All right, eight grams. 165 watts. Can't believe I'm missing little tongues because somebody thought this might be food or something. <sighs> you're lucky you're cute. and frothy. It is not a natural orange flavor. It's definitely like some kind of, you know, that orange toothpaste or fluoride at the dentist. I think that's what it smells like. It's like this fake orange, kind of like the dentist fake orange. That's what I'm going with. It's the fluoride that's orange flavored at the dentist. All right. Okay, luckily the flavor is a fake orange, kind of like those orange slices. Ooh, but there's like this perfumey chemical aftertaste. Starts out sweet and orangey like those uh, fake orange jelly slices and then goes to like this perfumey chemical it's not even bitter it's just perfumey chemical Ugh. let's try adding milk <coughs> I'm gonna spoon okay we'll just use the use the matcha scoopy why not Two matcha scoopies of milk powder. Let's see if that saves this. Why not just add milk? Uh, well, we don't usually have a lot of milk here because we don't use it a lot. 
Put it, uh, we don't drink it. I'm lactose intolerant, which weirdly I'm fine with the powdered milk, at least in the small creamer style quantities. Let's try with milk. Yeah, no, yeah, no, do not like 